Hello everyone! Okay, this is episode 3 of the Creating a Brand series. Today we're going to be creating marketing photos that I will be the model for. <laughs> um, and I just got the package printed, went to FedEx. Um, support local printers, but also if you have only a FedEx nearby, go to FedEx. Um, I have printed the package on cardstock and let's get to work cutting this out and putting it together so we can photograph it within our marketing photos. Okay, so let's start off this project by printing and putting together the package that we just printed. So I went to FedEx, like I said, and now we're going to be cutting out the package and really this is a tiring, cumbersome part of the project, but it is very rewarding. And also there's a bug on my window that made a weird reflection. It was really annoying me. Anyway, <laughs> um, I was cutting it out. I did make two copies of the printed package. Make more than one copy. This is my pro tip if you're ever doing this because I messed up this one and you'll see it in a minute. Um, I'm just kind of showing you this one is the one I recorded for reference, but I did mess it up a little bit. My lines weren't that clean with the cutting, but it ended up being okay. So now that we've cut it out, this one, I'm going to take a bone folder and a pencil and a roller to just line up where the folds are so i can mark it on the inside of the package so that was really helpful um, just to match it up to your reference package or you can always print with these types of guides too um, so i just did pencil marks to where i needed to fold everything and i took a bone folder which creases the pa like paper um, but i did crease it only on one side and i would to totally recommend doing the outside not the inside so I did mess up this one and it just wasn't as nice um, once I put it all together it just didn't look good so I wanted to do it again <laughs> here's the beautiful packaging So now it was time to take the photos. So what I'm doing is I'm taking my own marketing photos and being my own model just to have the reference of like the vibe of the brand without using all these photos <laughs> like from online or something. So what I'm doing is I'm putting together like a little collage of Polaroids. So my husband was helping me take some photos and it was actually really fun just to do this project. So I liked this aspect kind of getting into some art direction, taking the photo with the packaging, kind of just like a vibe, like nothing had to be perfect. We were just creating the essence of the brand, like creating the entirety of the brand, you know, all aspects, packaging, photos, marketing, social media, where all of this is going to go, like how would it be marketed? How would it be used? So um, in here, I did a little bit of like a lotion or like a cream on my face to show like different brand product images. and. My images are definitely not perfect. Um, I'm definitely not a photographer and also I don't have access to good equipment. So stuff like this, like the Polaroid and stuff was just kind of the aesthetic I wanted to go for. So I think that they turned out really great. We also went outside to take more photos just to have like a little bit of variety and it ended up just being really fun and perfect for the exact essence of the brand, like I said. So. That was kind of the experience. I ended up taking some photos on my phone as well. Of course, like I said, not super great quality, but still really cool and good and just what I wanted, essentially. And photographing it in the light just made it exciting and kind of fun and putting some like selfies together, like social media kind of vibe. I just want that to be part of the brand too. I don't want it to feel too serious, but I want it to be like classy put together. And I feel like I definitely achieved that with the type of photos I was taking. Ooh, okay, so. We just did a photo shoot. My husband helped me taking photos on the Polaroid camera. And we also took some like phone camera photos. So just kind of like a mix for the marketing purposes. You guys saw my mood board if you watched episode one. Um, so you saw the mood board. 
So now we've put together the package, we've photographed the package, we've made some marketing photos, and we're going to put those together into some mock-ups and maybe like a little web page mock-up too in the next episode. Yeah, you gotta wait, sorry. <laughs> I'm going to show you some edits that I've put together and the little collection of the Polaroid photos. So that's kind of like what we're doing now is we're just gonna put together like some of the photos to decide what we need for actual marketing. So this is kind of like an all aspects of design project. I mean, I wanted to go into some of like art direction and how I would photograph a brand like this and how I would put together a brand like this in terms of theme. So these are how the Polaroids turned out, my favorite ones. So now I brought it into my very dusty <laughs> little scanner on my printer and I scanned in the Polaroids so I could use them. So then I cut out all the photos and I started putting them together in their own individual PNG so they would have a transparent background and I could just use each one. And then I started putting together some posters. So here's a kind of fast version of me creating these little like posters that I was kind of experimenting with. We will see where I use them. I'm thinking maybe in a mock-up, um, maybe on like a social media post, I did create one. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna put these in the mock-up in the next episode to see if I like them. Um, so the, this is kind of just what I put together in terms of like the marketing that will go out if it were in the world. <laughs> um, so this is like my little design process for those. Hopefully you think this is interesting and you think they're good. I'm still experimenting. Like I said, I don't know what I wanna do with them yet. So probably we'll use them, we'll see. And then I put together some social media photos. So I ended up like making like a little Polaroid pile photo. And I really like this idea of a black background to showcase my work now. Um, I've been seeing a lot of people do it and I just think it looks really nice. I brought in the packaging to do the same thing with that black background. And then I put a little paper texture on the image um, just to show like it as a real package um, and then I did the same with this like putting a little poster together for social media so so that was really all the marketing I did okay everyone so I hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a like it really helps my channel if you're not subscribed what are you doing make sure to subscribe follow me on Instagram ring the bell do all the things I'll see you in my next one okay bye Okay, I'm done looking at myself in the viewfinder and we're gonna move on. <laughs>